thank you for joining us on our 20th anniversary and the formal introduction of the Tahitian Dreamliner. Thank you. Bright and beautiful and welcoming colors of yellow and orange and green. Reflective of the flora and fauna of the Tahitian Fenua, you will see Paul Gauguin paintings. It is vivid with the colors of the 50 shades of blue of the, of the lagoons. We named this plane Fakarava because Fakarava was, uh, was classified by the UNESCO for its biosphere. And the airlines, we took the position, I took the position with Mathieu at the airline five years ago when we decided to change from Airbus to the Dreamliner, when it was changing from a new generation of aircraft. We were involved in nine brand we thought at that time that uh, social and environment responsibility was key in our industry. And moving Airbus to Boeing was not such an easy decision. <laughs> and I remember one of our partners was telling us, guys, congratulations, but you're divorcing. It's like you're divorcing and you will sleep you with your wife for four years more. And in the same bed, so uh, it was quite, uh, quite tough. Hi, I'm Matthew Bishley, Managing Director of Fiat ATU. Business Cusp was one of the key elements that uh, we look very carefully about. Um, a 2 to 2 approach, probably a bit different from what you may see in other airlines with the 1 to 1. I think uh, the key aspect for us was to maintain the possibility to have a very light type of cabin, not too much of the monument, more on the seatings. Uh, we did uh, pay a lot of attention on the seating. Now we're in the traditional 2 meter bed flat which is critical for the high-end product. So Primarma Economy is an interesting one. When, when we initially uh, did our survey, because we didn't have Primarma Economy in the past, we for sure identified that there was a willingness uh, to pay for a big part of the market that goes to nice island and nice beautiful product, a very expensive one. We came up first by asking how much are you willing to to pay for a premium set and then we decided the product and what we did go beyond the expectation of what other airlines are doing so basically where an economy you will be on a nine abreast and some airlines are doing economy plus with just giving pitch we put seven abreast uh, we introduced the latest generation zodiac seat it's just been developed and certified with us on the 77-9 we went with, with the larger screen and you will see the ambience again and, uh, and the comfort, the pitch is way different from what you will see in traditional premium economy. The variation of the blues are from the back you will get the light blues which you will find on the shallow water of French Polynesia where the more you go to the premium you will get more of the deeper, of the deeper blues. So that's kind of the variation we've taken but the DNA of the color are still very attached to the one we have in French Polynesia. Some of the key parameters have not changed a lot. Tahiti is not about the massive flow of tourism with huge density of traffic. It's about keeping frequency, running long distances. When we were talking to Airbus a long time ago, we had some thought on making a small version of the A350-900 called the A800, or being a smaller type of aircraft because of the A350-900, composite aircraft, the same type of new generation aircraft that is the Dreamliner, which would have been a natural transition for us. Uh, the 900 was a bit too much of capacity, 30 to 40 more, 40 more seats. And looking at the number, we found it very clearly that there was not needed so much this new frequency, probably on LAX, but the rest of town on network we still have to build the capacity and the frequency. Capacity that this aircraft can bring you in an equivalent seating of the capacity of the A340, this aircraft would have given us the same type of LOPA, 30, 30 more seats, so instead of doing more seats we introduced the premium economy. But that was a perfect fit for us because it helped us to reduce our fuel cost, to reduce our, our maintenance cost. Also, the turbulence are reduced because of those uh, aerodynamic dy features they have on the wing, which helps a lot. So clearly, it's the perfect aircraft for long distance 
Airbus Brigier 350-900 program is chasing more the Triple 7 program. As a replacement to the A340, we decided to go with uh, Boeing because on this 300-seater type of aircraft running, again, long distance and field route, the, the 787 was by itself.